In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a custom text overlay. I don't like the text tool that comes with PhotoDirector. I find it really limited. So I use a website called PicMonkey, and I do my text there, and then I save it as a PNG, and then I bring it in. So I have an account set up, and it's really inexpensive. I think it's $4.95 a month, but it's also free if you don't want to use the premium if you don't want a premium account. There's just, if you have a premium account, you get more fonts and there's just some extras that you don't get with the free version. So anyways, the first thing that I do is I always do a custom size and then I always choose a four by six or six by four, which converts to 1800 by 1200. That's equivalent to a six by four. The width is always first. So I'll make it. And we'll keep it white right now, but after we type it out, we'll put it on transparent. But it's just easier to see with a white background. So say apply, click apply. And then come over here to the text tool and click Add Text, and then just click here where it says Type Your Text. You can drag that, click and drag it where you want it to be, and you can make this box wider if you think you're going to have quite a bit of text. And then just click in there and start typing. And I'm just going to do Command V because I've already typed it out. So this is the text I'm going to use. And I'm going to go ahead and uh, put this, uh, give it a um, transparent background. Go up here, go to Canvas Color, Transparent Canvas, and click Apply. And then let's crop this, and then just drag this, click and drag this box and resize it so that it's just the size of your text. And then click Apply. And then Export. And then I'll call it If You Live To Be 100. And I've already saved it, but you would just click Export to Computer and save it to where you save your files. So I'm just going to click Cancel because I've already saved it. And I'm going to go back to Photo Director. And then I'm going to come over here and add a photo layer. And find it. Pick Monkey. There it is, if you live to be 100. And then we just want to move it over, so click the Pick and Move tool. And click on to the text and just move it to where you want it to be. And that's it. And so you could use this to make a greeting card or a little poster or whatever you want. But it's a nice quick way to add text. And it's so much better than this text tool. So I hope you like this video.